Here we have some uh, work uh, from my project Secret Power, which uh, I developed for the uh, Venice Biennale uh, this year uh, for the New Zealand Pavilion. The work looks at um, images uh, found in uh, the uh, Edward Snowden uh, released NSA and other intelligence agencies slide presentations. So there was many things in that release, a lot of information, a lot of descriptions of different secret programs, but there were also a number of emblems and images used. Um, and I've taken examples of some of the most amazing images uh, in those slides and kind of drawn them up in a kind of uh, display case format to a sort of monumental scale. Um, so one example is I've taken a, uh, a logo used for the GCHQ, which is the British kind of intelligence agency, uh, for their um, program called um, Squeaky Dolphin, uh, which uh, tracks uh, many different things in different ways. Uh, it's quite a complex thing. Um, and, uh, and taking the emblem, which is a giant kind of, which is a dolphin with a kind of can of uh, lubricant spray uh, in, its, in its hands, um, and kind of made that into a sort of yeah, monumental version of it. Um, I've also displayed all of these things with information, with annotations, uh, in, in modified uh, computer units. So uh, when you have a number of uh, computers stacked in a dark data center, um, you use these kind of case, uh, these racks uh, which store the computers. And I've kind of modified those, um, put lights in them, put glass on the front of them, and kind of turned them into display case units. Um, so uh, it's also contrasted with a backdrop of, uh, of images made by uh, uh, Titian and, and Ver Veronese from uh, from the um, uh, Marchana Library in Venice, where the exhibition uh, first took place. Uh, these are images that have kind of become allegories uh, from that moment uh, when they were produced, uh, when Venice was at its height um, in the Renaissance, uh, as uh, allegories for the value of knowledge and the value of keeping knowledge. So you get a sense that there's a contrast between the way that knowledge was imaged and ima imagined at a certain point um, uh, in, in, a, in a context like the Venice Empire, in a way, and a contemporary moment when uh, uh, images for the value of knowledge and, and, and different types of intelligence are made in a kind of a different way. And uh, so you get a sort of sense of a contrast of, um, of older image-making systems, newer image-making systems, but how we imagine knowledge today.